Matt. Matt, wake up. We're almost there. Uh, what? What's going on? We're almost in Shivercliff. This is where Daddy grew up? In this shithole? Anne, what's your language? Yes, this is Daddy's hometown. Why haven't we ever been here before? We just never got around to it. Never got around to it for the 13 years I've been alive? <laughs> sure. Well, you always asked about your grandfather, Anne. Now you'll have a chance to meet him. I just think you might be disappointed. Maybe he's changed? You know, I believe anyone can change. Yeah, I hope he's changed. Otherwise, it's gonna be a short trip. Mom, I gotta go to the bathroom. We're almost there. Can't you hold it? No, I gotta go. Will you come with me? Oh, all right then. Come on, let's go. Matthew, please read this letter before throwing it away. I'm dying, Matt. And before I go, I'd like to see my daughter-in-law, granddaughter, and you. I haven't seen Ellen since your wedding. And Anne, my God, even longer than that. You have every right to hate me. I know I was a bad person. I know how much I hurt you and your mother. And I know that I can't fix anything now. I know I messed it all up. I wasn't the best father. Okay, I was barely a father. And I was barely a father-in-law or a grandfather. Too much time has passed for me to be able to fix any of that. But I still want to say goodbye to you all. Sometimes in life, we go down a road of no return. I went down that road. That was my choice. But now, I just want to see you before it all ends. Come see me in Shivercliff. I'll wait for you. I'll hold out until you arrive. Your father. P.S. If you don't catch me at home, Mrs. Bauer will tell you where to find me. You remember Libby, right? She lived across from us on the corner of Port Street and St. Patrick. 